Hello everybody, it's Detective Tipster here and today I want to show you N64 emulation on the Odroid C1. I chose a few games which I knew did not run very well on the Raspberry Pi 2, just to see how well the Odroid would do, but this is by no means a direct comparison. All these games are running using the Moopin64 Plus emulator, and I'm running them via Android. I'm actually overall quite pleased with how things run. Banjo-Tooie is so close to being playable, but it just doesn't have that smoothness and feel to it that Mario 64 does on this emulator. I loaded up Goldeneye, which I had a hard time with on the Pi, and this was a great improvement. It again, needs to be a lot smoother to make a playthrough enjoyable, but you can at least run through a few levels if you have the patience, which was not really possible on the Pi. Some people were quite disappointed that Perfect Dark was not running on the Pi, but it seems to be doing quite well here. I wish I did know what I was doing in this game so I could get further into it, and it's quite possible that once things in the world open up, we could get some slowdown. But from what I experienced, things worked great. Know your enemy, that's what I always say. The one thing I was most happy about is Mario Tennis. This game seems to have a lot of issues on every emulator, but it was at least playable, if not the prettiest, and you do have to put up with some slowdown between points. Last but not least is Conker's Bad Fur Day. And no surprise, but this is still not close to playable at all. It is running better on the Pi though, so that is a plus. So that covers my very quick test and should give you a good idea of what to expect if you are looking at a no-droid. With these entry-level computers we'll still need a little bit more power and emulation development to make N64 feasible. But we are getting there, and I am happy to see it progress. Stay tuned for more Odroid videos, but for now, enjoy some more footage from the games. What can I do for you?